Hey guys, um, yesterday I was talking to one of my viewers and he wasn't able to get like any mods installed on spin tires. So I decided to make a little video showing you how to install maps on spin tires. So basically what you want to do is you want to go like to a website like spintiresmods.com. Link will be in the description. And you want to go to like You've got two different categories here, Spin Tires Mods and Spin Tires 2014 Mods. Now, if you've got the newest version of the game on Steam, you would want to go to Spin Tires 2014 Mods, which is right over here, and then go to the subcategory Maps. You'll get an entire list of maps, like, they're so awesome, but yeah, people upload maps to the site and I've decided to go with um, this map, it's called Ridge, and um, basically what you want to do over on this website is um, check w which version it's compatible to. Now, this 19.03.15 actually marks the date, so it's the 19th of March 2015. Um, if you've got the newest version of Spin Tires, anything after 1st of March will actually uh, most probably work. I, I'm not promising it will, but it most probably will. Now you open the download button. Go. That takes you to this website. Click the free download thingy. No authorization or payment is required, so that's a good thing. Click download file and the file actually starts downloading. Um, after you've got that covered, you get a file like this, which is a 7z's um, dot .zip file. Open that and go to the folder, um, go to your Steam folder, like where you've got Steam installed. I've got it installed on different drive, but that's totally up to you. Go to um, Steam, Steam Apps, on. Clicking, <laughs> go to common, then search for spin tires, go and then to media. That's it. There, this is where you want to put the game files. Now, most of those files are uh, laid out in a map with the level name, but you don't want that one. Inside there is an older media, so that corresponds to your media folder in your spin tires folder. So if you open the media folder here and the media folder here, you've got a folder called Levels, and you just drag that one into there. So it'll actually extract. There you go. That's it. I've got some files in there, but they don't really matter as long as they work. Now, if you open up Spin Tires, if you click Play, and then click the map, it should be right there. Now I've got a save game on it, but you guys won't just be like one of these two. So if you open that one, click start new game. Yes. <laughs> there you go. Got your new map installed. Go exploring, uh, healing, <laughs> and of course the logging part. So I hope this is somewhat helpful. I will put the step-by-step -step description in the com in the description of this video and the link to this map. Now, installing a truck mod or a tweak or anything actually goes like exactly the same way, unless stated otherwise on the on the mod page. Don't go and do it like this because that won't work. You need to. You need to have the map, the folders corresponding to each other, so it's just going in there, going in there, like go into the media folder, drag the levels or wheels or whatever is in here, drag that to your mod or media folder. So um, I hope this video was somewhat um, helpful, and I'll see you guys another time. Bye bye. Comment standing by in three, two. One.